Join me for this ankle and foot routine that will help you warm up and increase the blood flow around the area as well as relieving pain. Start by sitting right in a chair and put your feet right under your knees. You may feel like taking your shoes off. You may wear your shoes, that's totally fine too. Either way, spread your toes, place them down and press the soles of your feet down into the ground. Notice how when you press down, when you ground down, you can rise up a little bit, getting a little bit taller. Feel free to close your eyes and for a few moments, just feel your ankles and feet. Feel the point of contact of your ankles and feet on the ground. Feel all the sensations, vibrations, blood flow. And then begin by lifting your heels off the ground, placing them back, lifting your toes up, place them down. So you're going back and forth, lifting the heels and toes. We are awakening those calf muscles, which helps to increase and improve blood flow, reducing any swelling or edema in the ankles. And now we're gonna lift the legs up. You may need to scoot back a little in your chair to get more comfortable there and lift your feet off the ground. They can be low, medium, high, whatever is comfortable for you. And then begin by pointing and flexing your ankles here, up and down. You may notice some snap crackles and pops. That's totally fine as long as it's not hurting you. If it is, then definitely make those movements smaller, more subtle. We're gonna draw some circles out and away from each other. Try to draw these circles smoothly and then go in toward each other. So you're reversing the direction of those circles. Pause, feel the resulting sensations. This next one, is one of the most important ones. Hopefully you can remember it and do it through the day. Anytime you're seated, turn the soles of your feet in toward each other. So they're turning in toward each other at the ankle, but a little bit of the hip too, feel that. And then turn the soles of the feet out away from each other. In toward each other, out away. Inversion, turning in. Eversion, turning out. A few more times, just like this. This is so important to build agility around the ankles, strength and mobility, because if you were to fall, often we tend to fall by twisting our ankles. So if we can strengthen around the ankles and even build more awareness, we're more likely to catch ourselves. Now, turn the soles in and stay here. Pause here. Don't do it forcefully, very gently. And feel how the muscles on the inner ankle are strengthening. They might be getting tired already. And feel how on the outer ankles, they're lengthening and stretching. Now let's turn the other way, turning the soles of the feet out. Feel how the opposite is true. The muscles on the outer ankles are strengthening. Can you feel what strengthening feels like? And the inner ankles are lengthening for the most part. Can you feel that? that stretching sensation. Turn in and out just a couple more times and then place your feet down. Rest your feet for a moment. Take a nice deep breath in, a deep breath out. Feel your feet. Lift your toes off the ground, spread them, and then place your big toe down, your little toe down, all your toes placed down. Pause here for a moment, feeling the point of contact of your feet on the ground. Pressing down, grounding down into your feet and into your chair to rise up and get taller. Take a nice cleansing breath here. Just feeling that glow around your feet and ankles. Feeling that increase of blood flow and letting the benefits soak in. Thank you so much and be well.
Hey, it's Ann Swanson here, yoga therapist and yoga for arthritis specialist. If you have any questions, feel free to write them in the comments and make sure you click subscribe as I'll be sending more videos out like this soon.